In the centre of the French countryside was a beautiful chateau, left abandoned and forgotten for over 40 years. Then, one year ago, a family from the UK fell in love with its beauty and embarked on an adventure. This is where, the whole town. where that big tree is there, you can see the, can see the pillar. To bring back to life this forgotten chateau. Join myself, Terry, my partner, Ash, my mum, Tracy, dad, Tony, and nephew, Jonathan, in our family adventure at Chateau de la Lasalle. So it's nice and sunny today um, and we found a couple of leaks in the dormer windows just it's not no fault of ours it's just where they don't fit properly so I've dragged Tony out dragged the ladders out and we're gonna just quickly put a little bit of wood underneath the sill where the water's coming in slightly and um, it's more of a temporary fix till the summer comes and we get the scaffolding up and then we can get it sorted uh, properly in the summer can't we yeah, all it is is the um, the weather bar on the bottom of the windows is uh, is set a bit high on the, the outside of the window, so there's a gap. And with them being up elevation, the wind blowing that way. And, the, and when, it's mainly when we get really the bad winds storms. The wind's driving the rain in. Blowing it in. So all I'm going to do is put a little um, a little bar in front. Mm -hmm. and hopefully um, that'll stop it for now. It's not my favourite sort of bar. I prefer the ones that do beer, but this will have to do for the day. Yeah. pins in before I go up make it easy so the problem we've got um, is the windows upstairs there's a there's quite a big gap under this drip board on the face of the window and with the windows opening in over we can't put anything sort of permanent on there because it won't drag in over so all I'm going to do is put a bead in front so that it's tight up to these to these drip boards this window is not as wide so um, it will actually come between the frame, nip up tight, and all I'm going to do is pin it down in place, a bit of silicon underneath, and um, that will stop the weather from driving up and under, because then it gets into the uh, into the void behind, and that's where we're getting some uh, some problems with a bit of a bit of damp and a few drips. So I'll put a few uh, few of these pins in down here um, before I go up try to minimise as much work as I can up there. Um, I'll get this up and uh, enjoy the sunshine while we can.
a silicon seal underneath this one um, and I'm just going to put a little bead on the inside to stop anything from dripping down and coming back through. It's a bit of a uh, labyrinth seal now so hopefully that will stop any weather but we do get some driving wind and it can get quite unpleasant so belt and braces is the best way I think. Just put a bit of silicon on now. Just fill this little void and, and give it a wipe. Little old Indian trick, just when you're smoothing down the uh, silicon, if you wet your fingers, just give them a lick. Stops the silicon from sticking to your fingers so well, and you get a nice smooth finish on the uh, bead of silicon. As long as you haven't put too much on, then it should be okay. So we'll just leave the silicon to uh, to dry for a little while and then we can get the uh, the windows closed over and um, wait for the next storm. Hopefully all will be well. Right, thank you. It's another job done. Well, hopefully it'll uh, it'll do what we want it to do and keep the rain out. Yeah, We can um, uh, get it stained up later as long as it yeah, works. Yeah, as long as it's, it, it keeps the rain out. That's one thing we've found about Chateau Life. Nothing nothing goes to plan you'll start one job and you get dragged to another then yeah. another so well when well the weather's like this <laughs> the windows have had a couple of days to dry out tony so. only come back with a cup of coffee and there was a pair of ladders on the roof and he just looked <laughs> i knew what was coming i didn't even ask i just went straight upstairs to get the silicon saw and some uh, you have to you pins. have to make that opportunity don't you to make the most of the weather and when jobs just, well, you just have that, to prioritise. There's that many day. little jobs that if you don't fit them in, you never get them done. No. And there's too no. many half-finished jobs. That's brilliant, great. So next storm we'll be able to check and give you the a rundown on whether it worked or not. Yeah, fingers crossed. I mean, it's obvious that that was a problem because there's yeah. a, a very visible gap. So okay. So that's great. one down. I'll go and find you another job. I think I've got enough. <laughs> So we just about finished this wall now. It took me about a week. Yeah, roughly a week. Um, and it's looking amazing now. I'm just trying to clean it down as much as I can now. Uh, I'm using just, just a wire brush. I used a little bit of the attachment on the tool to clean some of the bricks, the little wire brush on the, t on the drill. Uh, and I've just got a sponge now and some water. Someone had recommended putting white vinegar in in the water one of the viewers so i've tried that as well so i think it's just a case of now i've just keep washing it and washing it and washing it to get the the dust off the stone to make it look as original as i can so it's looking good it's looking nice and um, for a first time i think it's looking good i just have that one to do now <laughs> So I'll just keep washing and washing, probably spend all day today giving this a wash down, giving it a clean down, see how it dries tomorrow. Might have to do another hard brush tomorrow with it. Um, and then uh, I'm going to crack on with these. I've started a little bit of it, just taking these beams, I've got the two, taking them out. Just to, I'm going to put another one over the top. I'm going to chop some old beam out, put it over the top and have it sticking out a little bit. Just so it looks nice, it's a little feature in the bathroom, to be honest, um, instead of just blocking it all up. It's something that was there and it'd be nice to keep there. Maybe just put a little towel on it or towel rail or something. We'll have a look when that time comes soon, I hope. 
<laughs> it's very cool. We really all need a bath. <laughs> but yeah, I'll keep cleaning. Get it all done today and then tomorrow start on that one, which isn't as big because it's got the door there. So hopefully it won't take me as long. Superb. that's it this wall's finally finished a couple of little touching up to do as i'm in here messing about um this i'm gonna start on these two now i've just been looking for some beams where i can cut down to fit in there i think that look really really nice so i'm gonna carry on now drilling this is absolutely rock solid i don't know what the hell it is but it's rock solid so i'm just drilling it and then just going to chisel it to get out a little bit more than i can there and then just put another beam just the fascia on it and then that's this wall all done perfect and then start on that one in a couple of days when i've had a rest <laughs> what we got? so We've just been pulled by the posty man mm -hmm. for another parcel for us. Mm -hmm. Looks like it's come from uh, Han Hanmore in Germany. Yeah, we were just at, Han sat having some soup, weren't we? Yes, we were. on this so, cold day. Yeah, is it's freezing. Family short and Ashley. <laughs> 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 you, you're a little outcast. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shall we have a little look? I don't know if it was meant for Christmas. Um, I'm hoping it's another party frock. At <laughs> least for me. Oh, also. Oh, oh my God. <gasps> oh, wow. Chocolate. chocolate. Somebody oh, told oh, her that oh, I like white chocolate. Oh. What is that? It's a uh, chocolate. It's oh, like it's um, it's Christmas. Mm. Yeah, Germany Christmas. Mm. Oh. And they're white chocolate. And white chocolate lint. Oh. I've never seen them. That. It's me. I've never seen white chocolate ones. No. Mm. Wow. Oh, lint. I love lint. <laughs> you can have white chocolate. Thanks. And I love this. <laughs> <laughs> For all the model, is that lady and gentleman? Noble. Noble ladies and gentlemen. At Lalacelle. La Happy and sweet. and sweet New Year. Something for... In between. Mm. Your hard work. Oh, oh lovely, bless. lovely, lovely. Oh, bless. <laughs> yeah. oh, Thank you so much. We'll be sat having some of them tonight. <laughs> Look at this, a donkey that won't go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> have a few. Let's have a look. Oh, that is. Oh. Let's show the camera. Oh, sorry. sorry. That's how a donkey that won't go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <But> he moves. <laughs> oh, yes, that's what we need. Oh, what is that move? <laughs> yeah. <Twin> coins. <laughs> Oh, will I show Jonathan that? He'll absolutely do that. <laughs> he will think it's hilarious. Oh. Look at that. Yeah, it's a shame the donkey oh. doesn't do that. Look, poop mm. kind. Yeah. yeah <laughs> we well, we haven't actually checked, have we? <laughs> we'd we'd right. put up with his noise if um, he did that. Yeah, definitely. Oh. And what's the other one? That's oh, all right, yeah. So. It's nothing. It's just oh. our donkey that won't go to sleep. For yeah. Jonathan and the donkey that never sleeps. Friendship. Thanks for your beautiful vlogs. Your castle gets more brilliant day by day. Good success and keep warm. 
Fantastic. Thank you. Thank you oh, so much. And we are trying to keep warm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 The chocolate yeah. will help. It's absolutely freezing at the moment, yeah. isn't it? So we just, it's hard to get motivated, isn't it? Oh, yes, definitely. So. Isn't it absolutely fantastic You'll that? Love that. Yeah. I can't wait to show Jonathan because he will think that is hilarious. That is definitely, definitely yeah. Jonathan's humour, yeah. without a doubt. It'll disappear into one of his secret hiding places. Especially yeah. with the head moving. Yeah. 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 And it, that is definitely his humour. I can't, it's so funny. <laughs> also, we got um, these sent from someone, the little handmade I wrote it down. Christmas gifts. Oh, give them up two seconds. Do these two little gifts, which were beautiful. We've still got them out at the moment. Um, and there was I a did couple write of the cards. Was it a f one of these cards? Yes, yes, they're both on there. Uh, Josephine Willis, was it? Josephine Wills. Yeah. Wills. Yeah. Obviously, we just got these cards, so they were a bit delayed in the post. Um, but the well, she's blaming COVID, yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. Yes, and Jonathan Beautiful loved these armor. as well. He's yeah. put them on the TV, so I think yeah, he won't let us take them down. No, we're <laughs> just keeping them out. <laughs> amazing. Bless you. Oh, bless. But thank you so much for the chocolates because we absolutely love them. Yes. yes. Oh, yes. One of my favourite. I know it's Galaxy's my yours, isn't it, man? But I'm sure you'll have a go at them one. <laughs> <laughs> or oh, Cadbury's. Oh, yes. But Lint, you can't beat Lint. You can't beat Lint, no. Oh, definitely not. Oh, okay. Thank you so much. That is so, so kind. It really is so kind. Thank you, And guys. the little token, what was in my donkey. Yes. Thank you so much. Yes. You're so kind. You really are. Well, we'll have a this. quick chocolate and we'll get uh, back to work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man, Joe, we might not feel up to it after uh, a couple of those. Yeah, yep. bag each. <laughs> <laughs> right. Thank you. See you Thank soon. You. Bye. Bye. Today. So, somebody has sent this all the way from Germany for you. Germany! It's a present from your Christmas song. Uh, 12 Days of Christmas. Uh, it's a donkey that won't go to sleep. But it proves money. <laughs> <laughs> Look! You have a go then. You proves like money! <laughs> Do you like it? It eats. <laughs> And then you keep going, and it proves money. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say? Thank you. Thank you. What is inside that? It's just writing. It's Shows so a card. funny, isn't it? Show, me, show Terry the card. card. Show Terry. Yeah. <laughs> watch. So, do. watch your fingers from that. So watch. Yeah. Get it like that. Hold it. Pull that down. Yeah. It eats. Then after... Look! It's that proof of money. Poops! <laughs> <laughs> poops gold coins? I'll just show Nana. I've seen it. We need a donkey did. that poops gold coins what? only. Imagine if our donkey did that. Pull that down. Oh no. No, wait, I'll. I'll yeah, go then. So. Uh, go, so. Oh, no, it doesn't want to come out. Look, the it's written. Yeah, you don't want to put it back in. <laughs> <laughs> so, you ready? Go so, so. Mm -hmm. goes down. Yeah. It eats. <laughs> do you like How it? How good would that be? Yeah. Really good, that. You have to put it in your bedroom, you, won't you? How do you open it to write in? But <laughs> well, thank you again. I think it's thank hard. So I've just put a little bit of sailing strip in the bottom of the, the other dormer window um, it went in nice. The design of these windows is that they open in over and it's it's difficult to seal them from from uh, the driving rain. Where these are they're up a height so 
the wind blows the air in and drives it up underneath. Um, there are some drain holes in there but they just can't cope. So what I've done is I've put a little sill on the outside just to stop that. And as a second um, belt and braces idea, I've just got some of this, um, it's just draft excluder. And, uh, but because it, it compresses really well, um, it squashes down and fills the gap. So hopefully it'll be a, like say belt and braces, the, uh, the outside sill will stop the rain from driving in and then this will stop the draft from finding anywhere to go so then the water can't get in at all. So fingers crossed, it wasn't a big problem but uh, any sort of damps, not a good idea. So I'll just uh, get this one measured up, cut and um, we'll get it on. The other one went on really well so fingers crossed this is the same. Well, that's got a good contact in there now so hopefully it'll work as well as the other side and um, keep the keep the bits of moisture out so while I'm up here I've just been thinking what a fantastic view this is going to be to wake up to every morning no matter what the weather just look at that it's unbelievable superb view If you'd like to join us on our family journey, bring them back this once forgotten chateau, then please join us on Patreon for behind the scenes footage, updates, live chat, and your very own piece of the chateau.